Summary Tiki's Elton John and Harry Potter Night performances of Were Fantastic, showcasing his impressive vocal range. The clues to Tiki's identity include references to being a rock star and selling millions of records. The panelists had varied guesses for Tiki's identity, with John Stamos, David Lee Roth, Dave Grohl, John Bon Jovi, and Robert Plant being mentioned. The Masked Singer Season 10 introduced four new mystery celebrity singers on a celebration of Elton John Knight, including Tiki, and there are many clues to his true identity. Host Nick Cannon and panelists Robin Thicke, Jenny McCarthy Wahlberg, Ken Jeong, and Nicole Scherzinger have all returned for the Masked Singer's milestone season. It kicked off on premiere night with the reveal of Anonymous as Demi Lovato, one of the biggest unmaskings in the show's history. The Masked Singer Season 10 Group B consists of Hawk, Husky, Tiki, and Royal Hen. Hawk, Husky, and Tiki moved on to the next round, Harry Potter Night, while Royal Hen was unmasked and revealed to be legendary tennis player and activist Billie Jean King. During Harry Potter Night, Sea Queen was added to Group B, while Hawk was unmasked and revealed to be actor and musician, Tyler Posey. Here are the clues to help figure out Tiki's identity. Tiki's Elton John Knight performance clues During the Masked Singer Season 10 Elton John Knight, Tiki sang a fantastic version of Goodbye Yellow Brick Road, showcasing his vocal range with some impressive high notes. When he first came out on stage, Jenny said that he looked really tall, and pointed out that people have to know how to walk in heels like his. Tiki's clue package began with the title, Behind the Tiki, from the channel MS10, which was a nod to Behind the Music, the tell-all show about singers and bands from VH1. Tiki opened the clue package by screaming all right, in a high-pitched rock star voice. Tiki was then shown inside a recording studio saying, From as far back as I can remember, I've always wanted to be a rock star. As a kid, I knew I had the pipes. Tiki was then standing next to an alarm clock flashing the word, snooze, in red letters while he said, So when my dream came true, it made perfect sense. Tiki was next seen walking in a room with a globe, two tikis, and four records hanging on the wall that said, Tiki number one. He continued, I got to sell millions of records, travel the world, and party with some of music's biggest names. At that point, a human skull was shown. Tiki then admitted, but I was a stiff drink with a loose mouth, and I got myself in a lot of trouble. Tiki's friend, Pineapple, was then shown sitting in a dark room next to a piano. It was so dark that his face couldn't be seen. He shared, yeah, he definitely rubbed some people the wrong way, so it was no surprise a few of them wanted to rum punch him in the face. Tiki went on to say, after all the highs, I was left fearing my career would be poured down the drain. Tiki was then shown in a black and white scene laying on a couch in a trashed room. His portrait on the wall was crooked. Then, a monkey in a party hat appeared in the room. Tiki continued, instead, I cleaned up my act, stepped out on my own, and showed that I am still at the top of my game. Tiki was then shown in another black and white scene, but this time he looked strong and powerful, standing on stage in front of a crowd of adoring fans. Tiki concluded his clue package by saying, and as for these other singers? I am here to Tiki home that golden mask. 
and you're all grasping at straws. After Tiki's performance, he danced around, with Jenny noting that he was very agile. Robin predicted that everyone would know Tiki when he was unmasked. He noticed he was walking in platform heels and effortlessly singing and moving, and guessed that he was a legend, icon, rock vocalist. Another clue was revealed about him which was one of the men in black playing Elton's song, I guess that's why they call it the blues, on the piano. Tiki explained, if you're ever feeling bluesy, you can come to me for a good laugh. He then laughed heartily. Tiki's Harry Potter Night Performances Clues for Tiki's first Harry Potter Night Performance, he sang an enchanting rendition of Magic by Pilot. He began his clue package by saying, making my debut last week was just beachy. And now, getting to perform again on Harry Potter Night feels pretty fitting cause I've really found the magic in my life these days. The camera then zoomed into an empty restaurant and bar, in which Tiki was snoring while sleeping on a staircase. He went on to say, there comes a time in every rockin' tropical cocktail's life where they need to decide what comes next. He was then startled awake by a loud rock guitar chord, letting out a little O. Tiki continued, do you let yourself get watered down? He played some notes on a piano, and then said, or do you change with the tides? From behind the bar, Tiki shared, I decided to put the hard partying lifestyle on the back burner. And my family on tap. Tiki then walked over to a garbage pail that had a clock in it. The clock's hands turned from 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. He said, I used to be up every night partying until 6 a. M. Now that's what time my alarm goes off to take my kid to school. He looked out the window and waved, as a yellow school bus drove away. Tiki continued, it makes me emotional just thinking about it. A yellow box of tissues with a sad face on it was then shown. Tiki then said, I definitely don't want tonight to be my last call, so when I get out on stage, you're gonna see that this Tiki is still on the rocks. Tiki was shown making five Tiki drinks, four with purple flowers and one with a blue one. They seemed to represent a group with a lead singer. When Tiki finished his performance, another clue about him was revealed. The Harry Potter sorting hat sorted Tiki into Gryffindor, saying, brave at heart, daring. Better be, Gryffindor. Tiki explained his Gryffindor connection saying, you gotta be brave to be front and center of the types of stages I command. Later in the night, Tiki went into the Smackdown with Hawk, during which they both sang Monster by Lady Gaga. Tiki made it to the Group B final, while Hawk was unmasked and revealed to be Tyler Posey. Tiki's identity prediction The Masked Singer panelists had some very varied guesses for Tiki's identity. Jenny thought that maybe he could be a comedian who knows how to sing. She mentioned that there are many comedic Broadway people who can sing beautifully. She wondered if maybe Tiki was an actor known for singing, a rocker who made everyone laugh, and someone who's been on Broadway, and guest John Stamos. She also pointed out that John has toured with the Beach Boys, which is reflected in the Tiki costume. However, Nicole felt that Tiki was a singer. She guessed David Lee Roth, the former lead singer of Van Halen. She referenced their videos with their tongue-in-cheek energy. Robin thought that the vocals were screaming rock god legend. 
He used the snoozed alarm clock to guess Led Zeppelin's Robert Plant, whose solo album was titled, Dreamland. After Tiki's Harry Potter night performance, Nicole gushed that his vocal was so powerful that she felt as though Freddie Mercury had come back. Robin added that his voice is so iconic and so legendary, and doesn't sound like anybody else. He said that they should know who it is. Ken guessed first, saying that he's Dave Grohl, lead singer of the Foo Fighters, but Jenny disagreed. Nicole thought Tiki might be John Bon Jovi, while Robin mentioned Roger Daltrey of The Who. However, he didn't think Tiki had Roger's voice. Instead, he said that he thought vocally, Tiki was closer to his original guess of Robert Plant. Tiki had a powerful performance on The Masked Singer Elton John Knight, which proved that he's a true star. He continued to mix things up on Harry Potter Night, and will be sure to pack a punch in his next performance as well. He's now made it to the Group B Finals along with Husky and Sea Queen. There will be many more clues about Tiki because he's certain to go very far in the Masked Singer Season 10 competition. The Masked Singer airs Wednesdays at 8pm Eastern Daylight Saving Time on Fox.